the sea state also is expected to remain amenable for the recovery seconds. operations that are going to take place soon after the touchdown of the crew module Minus in the Bay of Bengal. Seconds. Minus 40 seconds. Minus 35 seconds. Minus 30 seconds. PSPP opened. Real time programs activated. Minus 25 seconds. Minus 20 seconds. Minus 15 seconds. 10, 9, 8, 7, 6, 5, 4, 3, 2, 1, 0. TVD1 ka safalta poon prajwala. Plus 5 seconds. Pradhan, Pradhan promotion manch se. Here we have a textbook lift off of TVD1, a major milestone towards Isro's Gaganyan mission. Due to tracking. Plus 15 seconds. Test vehicle performance normal. We have a confirmation from seconds. range operations director that the test vehicle is Shara performing Vinayana normally. Plus 25 seconds. Vajjanikho ne chan ke saans li. Plus 30 seconds. Khushi ki lahar yaha. Pillbox conditions will be achieved during the flight regime. Ji haan, Rohan ke rambi jari hai. Performance normal. TVD1 ka pranod samanya plus one minute. Engine thrust cut off. CES separated. HGM motors are ignited. Grid vent deployed. TVD1 ko prithak kar diya gaya hai. Or CES, CM saath mein coasting phase mein hai. Grid vents deploy kar diya gaya hai. Quick succession of events here. All the events have been taking place as per the prediction. The grid fins have been deployed. The test vehicle has been jettisoned. This crew member is separated. CJM motor ke firing ke saath crew module ko crew escape system se separate kar diya gaya hai. Now the crew escape system has been jettisoned. The apex cover has has been jettisoned, and now the orbital module is reorienting itself under aerodynamic loading. Jee haan, iske saath hi descent phase shuru ho chuka hai crew module ka. Plus two minutes. Are decelerating the crew module. Around 200 seconds of this regime will adequately bring down the velocity of the crew module. Thereafter, the pilot shoots will deploy the main parachutes. Drog shoot deploy किए जा चुके हैं. यह करीब 16 किलोमीटर की ऊंचाई पर deploy कर दिए गए थे. और करीब 200 सेकेंड्स में क्रू मॉड्यूल की गति को 152 सेकेंड से 62.8 मीटर प्रति सेकेंड तक लाएंगे। On your TV screens, the visuals, the real time visuals of the drogue parachutes in a deployed condition, being captured from the crew module, current altitude. 10 kilometers. Plus 3 minutes. This gram me, agli ghatna, jab uchai 2.4 kilometer ki reh jayegi, tab drogue parachute ko crew module se alag kar diya jayega, tatha pilot or main parachute deploy kiya jayenge. Crew module ki gati पूर्ण निर्धारित तरीके से कम की जा रही है यह ड्रोग पैराशूट के कर्षण के कारण होता है The intent of drogue parachutes is to reduce the velocity of crew module from 145 meters per second to 51 meters per second Current velocity 61 meters per second क्रू मॉड्यूल धीरे-धीरे नीचे आता हुआ ड्रोग पैराशूट प्लस फोर मिनट्स उसकी गति कम की जा रही है 
सत्तावन मीटर प्रति सेकेंड है अभी वर्तमान गति है उसकी नेक्स्ट फ्लाइट इवेंट विल बी ट्रिगर्ड बाई सेंसिंग द ऑल्टीट्यूड ऑफ टू पॉइंट फाइव किलोमीटर्स विच इज द डिप्लॉयमेंट ऑफ पायलट शूट एंड देन द मेन पैराशूट We are at an altitude of 4.7 kilometers. अब तक पूरी गतिविधियां पूर्ण निर्धारित तरीके से जारी हैं। ऊंचाई धीरे-धीरे कम होते हुए, गति लगभग 50 मीटर प्रति सेकंड। यहाँ हम स्क्रीन पर देख सकते हैं दो ड्रोक पैराशूट्स लगभग पांच दशमलव छह मीटर व्यास प्लस फाइव मिनट हैं विजुअल्स ऑफ ड्रोक शूट्स तो रिलीज मेन चोक डिप्लाइड एंड देयर इस अ कंफर्मेशन दैट ड्रोक शूट्स हैव बीन रिलीज एंड पायलट शूट्स हैव एनेबल्ड द मेन पैराशूट्स टू डिप्लाइ these main parachutes which are three in number are very very large in size 25 meters each khoobsurat nazara ye teen main parachutes deploy ho chuke hain aur ye wo antim charan hai jab preview module ki gati ko 8.5 meter prati second se kam le aaya jayega aur preview module touch down karega to bring down the velocity of impingement in the sea to around 8.5 crew module in descent phase with main chute plus 6 minutes relative velocity now 12 meters per second we are at an altitude of 1.6 kilometers परीक्षण पूर्व निर्धारित तरीके से जारी है गति धीरे धीरे कम होते हुए अब 15 मीटर प्रति सेकंड रह गई है और ऊंचाई 1.5 किलोमीटर इंडियन नेवी टीम इज रेडीली डिप्लॉयड इन द सी अराउंड श्रीहरिकोटा कोस्ट फॉर क्विकेस्ट पॉसिबल रीचिंग टू द क्रू मॉड्यूल एंड देन रिकवरिंग इट अंत में टचडाउन के पश्चात मेन पैराशूट को भी क्रियो मॉड्यूल से अलग कर दिया जाएगा तथा क्रियो मॉड्यूल अपने आसपास रंग बिखेर देगा जिससे इसे लोकेट करने में आसानी होगी वहां सुरक्षित दूरी पर तैनात प्लस सेवन मिनट भारतीय नौसेना के पोत इसके पास जाकर उसे रिकवर करेंगे द क्रू मॉड्यूल इज प्रोवाइडेड विथ फ्लोटेशन सिस्टम and it will be remaining afloat until the recovery crew reaches it to aid in recovery sea markers and location transmitters are provided to be identified at the quickest possible time ye sab astronauts ko surakshit prithvi par wapas lane ki prakriya hai टचडाउन की स्थितियां प्राप्त की जा चुकी है As we told you, 8.5 meters per second is the benign touchdown velocity. We are now observing around 9 meters per second velocity, while the altitude is around 600 meters. सभी गतिविधियां पूर्व निर्धारित तरीके से पूर्ण हो रही हैं। इससे पता लगता है कि वैज्ञानिकों की गणना कितनी सटीक है विश्वसनीय है 
और उसका ही प्रदर्शन आज यहाँ किया जा रहा है प्लस नाइन मिनट थ्री हंड्रेड मीटर्स ऑल्टीट्यूड ऊंचाई धीरे धीरे कम होते हुए 200 मीटर की ऊंचाई रह गई है गति 5 मीटर प्रति सेकेंड वेन द क्रू मॉड्यूल टच इज डाउन eventually the main parachutes also will be released away from the crew module impact is sensed now the confirmation is available for a successful splash down of the crew module yahan iski ghoshna kar di gayi hai crew module ko surakshit touch down kara diya gaya hai bangal ki khadi par विजुअल देख सकते हैं खुशी की लहर वैज्ञानिकों में जूबलिएंट एम्बियंस इन द मिशन कंट्रोल सेंटर हियर एट सतीश धवन स्पेस सेंटर श्री हरिकोटा ऑन योर टीवी स्क्रीन द विजुअल्स लाइव फ्रॉम द बे ऑफ बेंगाल मिशन डायरेक्टर दिस इज मिशन डायरेक्टर द टीवी डी1 मिशन हैज फुल्ली अकॉम्प्लिश्ड इट्स ऑब्जेक्टिव द क्रू मॉड्यूल हैज सेफली लैंडेड द टारगेट पॉइंट मिशन उद्देश्य प्राप्त कर लिया गया है अब आपको संबोधित करेंगे इसरो अध्यक्ष श्री एस सोमनाथ इसरो हैज अचीव द सक्सेसफुल टेस्ट व्हीकल फ्लाइट एंड हैज मूव द स्टेप क्लोजर टू द प्रेस्टीजियस गगनयान मिशन वी टेक लीव फ्रॉम यू डू कंटिन्यू टू स्टे ट्यून फॉर द एड्रेस बाय सेक्रेटरी डीओएस चेयरमैन इसरो श्री एस सोमनाथ आप सभी दर्शकों को शुभकामनाएं हम आपसे आज्ञा लेते हैं शिवमार शिवमार अन हटन हटन शिव हटन I am very happy to announce the successful accomplishment of the TV D1 mission. The purpose of this mission was to demonstrate the crew escape system for the Gaganyaan program through a test vehicle demonstration, in which the vehicle has gone up to a uh, Mach number, which is a speed of sound slightly above that. and initiated a an abort condition for the crew escape system to function uh, it uh, took the crew escape system took the crew module away from the vehicle and uh, subsequent operations of the crew module separation from the crew escape system all the parachutes opening and touched down on in the sea at the required velocity has been very well accomplished and we have got confirmation of the data of all of this and uh, we will be further doing the uh, approach recovery operations of the crew module to be collected from the sea brought to the port by the ships that activity will continue to happen uh, till now based on the data everything has performed very nominally and perfect i will also like to tell the reason for why we had a hold uh, we initially wanted the launch to happen at 8 o'clock in the morning uh, but there was some weather related issues we have rescheduled the launch to 8:45 am but after going through the nominal lift off process there was a hold issued by the ground computer which is called the uh, automatic launch sequence computer which detected a sort of a uh, non conformance for allowing the engine to continue the thrusting to further go so this happened due to a monitoring anomaly in the system so we could identify it very very fast and correct it and uh, to make the stage ready it took some time to refill the gases and that once that has been completed we went through the proper 
automatic launch sequence which uh, checked the entire health of the vehicle and finally the mission computer and the ground checkout computer authorized the launch to take off which uh, released the rocket from the launch pad and subsequent activities of the flight as well as the post uh, termination about uh, sequence also got executed perfectly. So I'm very happy that our team could understand uh, in case of any anomaly how to rectify, rectify and come back fast as fast and uh, congratulations to everybody. Uh, this is a big training for the entire team here to prepare for the Gaganyan program. I'm very happy that launch could take place today within the allocated launch window. Uh, and we will come back with more analysis and data of this mission uh, on uh, recovery of the crew module, which is happening now. We are having uh, views from uh, coming from the sea, from the drones, cameras, which are being taking them. Uh, and before that, before we get any further updates, I would like to introduce the mission director, Sri S. Shiva Kumar, and the director of the crew module and crew escape system uh, to you. So over to Shiva Kumar. Thank you, Chairman Isro. All center directors, uh, senior members, MRR and FRR team, and all distinguished uh, guests. Uh, it's like no words are uh, <laughs> not coming up. Yeah. Sir, this is like, you know, uh, never before attempt. It's a bucket of uh, three experiments put together, and we have now seen the fragrance and the, uh, the characteristics of all three systems with what we wanted to test through this experiment or this mission. The test vehicle, the crew escape system, the crew module, everything, I think we have uh, like, no, perfectly demonstrated in the very first attempt, uh, but for the initial hitch, but that's nothing of a problem at all. All the systems performed well. I thank you for all the support provided by the entire uh, team of ISRO across all centers of uh, VSSC, LPSC, IPRC, IASU, SDSC, HSFC, etc. Thank you all, sir. It was a like, you know, penance for us for the last three, four years, and then we have reached that D-day today. And it was a very happy occasion that we could make it on the very first attempt. Thank you. Now, uh, Mr. R. Hutton, he is the uh, uh, mission executive for the crew module realization. And also the mission director of the Gaganyan. Excellent. Hearty congratulations to all, my dear team ISRO and team India. As uh, mission director has already said, I'm not getting any words to appreciate the whole team. In fact, it's <laughs> as far as the Gaganyan program is concerned, this is the first major milestone. In fact, this is going to be a great motivator for all of us in the Gaganyan, cut across all the ISRO centers. And in this particular Gaganyan, the most important is the safety of the crew. And this, the safety of the crew that has been demonstrated in this excellent mission, the test vehicle mission, where we have simulated an abort and how the crew escape system carries the crew module away like a bird, like a, a bird is taking its chicken and then uh, to a safe place. You know, the Gaganian vehicle, though it is fully robust and reliable, but then we can't take anything to the chance. And therefore, if any malfunction happens, there has to be a system in the launch vehicle which is called the crew escape, which will take the crew module away and safely take the crew module and then land. This is what exactly has been demonstrated today in this first mission of the test vehicle. So at this moment, I would like to thank and congratulate the test vehicle project team led by Mr. Shivakumar, the mission director, his vehicle director, Mr. Shivamurugan, and all associated members of the project, the centers, not only from Vikram Sarabhai Space Center, cut across all the ISRO centers who have contributed for this launch vehicle. It's a novel vehicle which has been derived from the liquid propulsion, the snap-on stage of the GSW, but entirely it's a new architecture. And I also like to congratulate the escape, the escape what is made possible through the crew escape system, the team behind me, the led by Mr. Sunil, as well as Mr. Anand, yeah, and all the centers who have contributed, and the crew module. The crew module, in fact, the total Assembly integration has been done by the new center, Human Space Flight Center. The young team, which are in the 20s to 25s, that age group has totally done it. Of course, there are old seniors are also there who are young at heart, who are also guided them, not only from this Human Space Flight Center, but great support from VSSC and all other centers who have contributed many systems for the crew module. So I take this opportunity to congratulate all our teams at Human Space Flight Center and all the other centers of ISRO. And all <laughs>
न्यूज फर्स्ट निर्भीत निम्बर